mashed potato and gravy vending machine. And these custom personal urns look like your head and store your cremated ashes. Vsauce, Kevin here. This is my world. Kiss Me is a telepresence device that transmits your kiss. It can measure and translate the lip pressure, shape, and movement of both users' lips and reproduces it all in real time. The Singapore-based developers Lovotics see this technology being not only used in human-to-human -human interactions, but also human-to-robot, human-to-virtual character, and robot-to-robot. -robot. So yeah. Face is a realistic humanoid designed to mimic human facial muscles and expressions. The system dubbed the Hybrid Engine for Facial Expression Synthesis utilizes 32 motors underneath polymer skin and the Facial Action Coding System which categorizes facial expressions based on muscle movement. Hello, my name is Upside Down Cat. Neurologists at Washington University in St. Louis are reading monkeys' minds. By analyzing the activity of large populations of neurons, they discover what actions the monkeys were planning before they made a single motor movement. Basically, a monkey put its hand in the center of a table and was told to move it to a different area. When obstacles were introduced, they could see the different strategies for overcoming them in the neural activities before the monkey physically moved. Enable Talk are special sensory gloves that give a voice to sign language. Developed by Quad Squad, a Ukraine team, the gloves are fitted with flex and touch sensors and can translate sign language into text and then spoken word through a smartphone. <laughs> For a glove that could improve sensation and motor skills for people with spinal injuries, there's the Mobile Music Touch. Developed by researchers at Georgia Tech, it works in conjunction with light-up keys on a keyboard and sends vibrations to the fingers that should be playing that key, indicating where and when to tap. Remarkably, participants have already claimed to have regained some sensation as a result of using this system. Look at the arms on that bus! Yeah, he must work out. To have an ecosystem on your desk, there's Ecosphere, a self-sustaining ecosystem filled with filtered seawater, microorganisms, small shrimp, algae, and bacteria. The makers claim the average life expectancy is two years, but can see shrimp populations thriving for seven years inside these things. And they were developed by scientists at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory. Now say hello to Aerographite, the new lightest material ever made. It has a density of less than 0.2 milligrams per cubic centimeter and is made of a network of hollow carbon tubes grown at nano and micro scales. It's mostly just empty space, but it looks like a black sponge and could eventually be used as part of an ultra lightweight battery. Finally, the V-Motion project uses Kinect technology to create a visual instrument. I'm going to leave you with a flame being put out with sound. And as always, thanks for watching. Hey Vsauce, check out this clip of Michael and I on Pop Spot Slow as a Mofo show. <laughs> Click here to watch a bunch of YouTubers in slow mo, and while you're over at Pop Spot, make sure you subscribe.